Hi, follow along as we build an off-grid homestead and explore our Alaska. In this week's episode, we'll be starting to frame our walls and build an outdoor shower. As you can see by looking at the trees, it was really windy and really hard to hold this in place. Again, the wind was causing us a lot of problems. I was trying to get it plumbed up before we put the braces on, so I had to take them back off a couple times. And took a little bit of doing. give us a little leeway here because this is like literally the first wall I ever framed in my life so yeah it was it was a learning experience
wall one is up we got the uh, back wall finish which is eight foot tall we then went ahead and started working on the front wall which is a little more difficult just because it's uh, got more framing with extra windows and it's got the door in there and there's also a four foot pony wall on top of the eight foot wall for a total of 12 foot in the front This fucking thing is in the middle. Yep. Hold on, let's the thing is, it moved, it slid forward. I know, and that's gonna be a problem. It should, when it hits those, it should push, right? Start dragging and dragging down. Yeah. Um, I, I what are you doing? I'm trying to get this thing ready to move further. Maybe we need to go in here and bend it. What? What do you want to do? I want to try to get under it. All right, let's go. Um, Stop. Yeah, we gotta be able to do this all at once. Well, what are you doing over there? I don't think that's gonna work, yeah. I don't, I don't know. Maybe it might. It might work. Okay, pull up this thing, get this, this thing underneath this. One, two, three, four, five. Alright, you go. A little break. I'm come over here. Yeah. You take that right, thing in. As far as it goes. As far as this. Alright, I'm gonna try to. Uh, you know what? Just me and you, and we'll have mom pushing these in. Let's scoot this a little further. Yeah, yeah. Let me come up in here. All right, Mama, come over here. We're gonna, no, we're, tell me what. We're going to lift it, first. get this thing further underneath us. One, two, three. Good. Good. Let's go over there. Chris, hold this up. This is the key break. You know what? Hold on a second. Let me. Yes. None of these are going to work. I'm just wasting time. We don't have anything to kick back into. Alright. Alright, it's set in here. Well, it's still <coughs> a little break. I need a James down there. Are you going to try to fit like a board from there to the ground? Yeah. Oh, 
scares as hell, though, so... It may not look like it, but this section of wall was very heavy, and we were having a really hard time getting it up. I think Chris is wishing he'd went off to military school at this point. What did you do? Didn't do anything. What game? I don't think it's all big. It's it's sitting on it. All right, everybody, sit down a little bit. Okay, we need to get one up underneath here. Yep. All right, guys, come over here. Look at the nail gun. Yeah, it's fine. I feel like I'm taking a lot of weight currently. Oh, hold on. Something. Get out of it. Get out of it. Get out of it. Let it down easy. Let it down easy towards me. Do you know how much weight there is there? No, it's fine. Okay. I'm just going to get away from it. No, I'm just going to sit here and hold it. Just to keep yeah. everything steady. Let's get a game plan here. What are we doing? Ooh, I don't, I don't know. know. Get in the wind down, maybe. We'll leave these here so that the falls. Well, I think sideways may be the better bet, maybe. Because then yeah. you can I'd say all the OSHA people are cringing right Maybe now, right have, about now. It's currently touching all of those. This little board in the middle is not going anywhere. No. Hanging out, doing its thing. It's attached. That's attached to the ground. You can't see it, but the compressor hose was pulling the sawhorse out from holding the wall up, and I started freaking out. And I know I didn't have to be holding it, but it felt like if I walked away and let go, it was definitely going to fall. Okay. I've seen it move. Well, 
You've not done enough sketchy shit in life, I guess. Apparently so, so. not. Apparently not. Hey, at this point we just need to go. Okay. Uh, let's see if we can go. Right? Yeah, I think it's right. about that. Okay. I don't know if we should be here or if we should come up here. I don't know. Well, I think we yeah. should probably go there. Or maybe in the middle of it. I don't know. Well, I, let's I can't leave things like sideways. Alright, so let's try. Everybody ready? Yeah. One, two, three. Okay, not That's working. That's not going to work. work. Too much weight. That's uh, not going to work. You'll have to be up here at least to... Uh, there's a lot of weight here. Yeah, yeah, there is a lot of weight. It became apparent we weren't going to be able to lift this wall by hand. It was just too heavy. It's 12 foot tall by 24 foot wide. We decided to go get the side by side and hook the winch up to it to help pull it up. But even that, we had to brace the wheels because it was pulling the side by side forward instead of pulling the wall up. Is it? Yeah. Do it. Put these blocks in front of me. That and hold your brakes. Like I said, if that thing snaps, you need to be able to... She was having a hard time hearing me, but I was trying to tell her that to watch out if that cable was a snap, to, she needs to duck her head because it could come through the windshield and get her. That doesn't do it and put it over here. Yeah. All right, let's pull it out. Put it right here. This way. We're not right there. Right here, maybe? Right here, maybe? Straighter. All right, we ready, Chris? Ready? Ready? Whoa, whoa, whoa! Chris, come over here. Come over here. All right, go. All right, stop. Go a little bit more. A little bit more. A little bit more. Nice. All right. Um. All right, right about there. Just stop it right there. Don't let it out. Let it out. Let it out. We don't want it too much. All right. Come out. Come over here. So we're going to have to get some bracing on this thing now. Uh-huh. Do what? Well, you're going to come over and help hold because uh, we're going to we're gonna put some bracing on. That was weird because it was taking all the weight, but all of a sudden this side wasn't getting yeah. okay. It was stressful, but we did finally get the front wall up and braced. After that, we decided to work on an outdoor shower. Uh, we did install a hot water Camp Lux 
heater in it, but unfortunately the igniter doesn't work, so we had cold showers that day. Um, if you guys have any ideas what might be wrong with it, let us know in the comments, and remember to like and subscribe, and we'll see you next week.